And what's up, everybody? Terminator Juice back with another Rocket League tips and training training tips video. I'm going to show you uh, Shadow Defense. Here's the code. The best I've gotten is 12 out of 20. There's a couple that, even if you think you save the shot, it doesn't count. I don't know why, but the basic idea of Shadow Defense is when instead of just driving towards the ball on defense all the time. Sometimes you know that they're going to get there first, so you drive away from the ball, and it gets gets you in a better position. You don't get just one shot. You get, um, you know, you're you're in a way better position to defend. So imagine they come from their they're coming from their side. You can't get to the ball, so you turn. You're driving away, and then they take the shot, which is what will happen here. So. It's good practice. It's a good way to defend instead of just driving at the ball. Um, but these do get pretty tricky. I find it's better for these just to kind of drive away and then come back. It gives you a better angle. You, uh, oh, When I miss one, I'll kind of show you. That wasn't the best. Now let me redo that one. See, that was a way better uh, way to do it. Now you can try to just go right away. God, I'm backflipping like crazy. I haven't been backflipping much lately. You know, you can go right away or you can kind of drive away. And uh, that was a little risky, but, you know, just practice different ways. Don't just do it the same way every time. So then here's one where it's a little less, get a little less opportunity. Let's see if that counts. Hopefully it does. Yeah, it counted. All right, so then you get one where it's a little bit of a, Harder shot, and I missed, you know. But this is great practice. It's good for boost jumping practice, um, air, aerial practice, you know, positioning your car, flying backwards and stuff, where I'm not that great, obviously. But, um, you know, I can do this instead. That's a, probably the better approach. Sometimes you find that patience is is the better than just trying to go straight at it like this, even though I got it there. But I just kind of left the ball. What you want to do is hit it to the corner. That's ideally what you want to do. So that's not what you want to do. I wonder if I have time to get up the wall. There's another, you know, you can practice all different kinds, so um, it's just, man, I didn't think I was going to get that one. But I've noticed since I've, I mean, just basic car control, getting better at car control and aerials, I've gotten way better at defense, and this is a tribute to that, too. Ooh, that was close. You know, you do the air roll, sometimes it's better just to turn the car around instead of trying to fly backwards, upside down, just turn your car around. See if it gives me that one. No, it didn't. And then one thing, it doesn't always give you the the point. So this is more of a backboard shot. And sometimes you don't get the point for it, even though I did. Maybe, it, maybe you can't drop it right in front of the goal. Not really sure. See, that's exactly what you don't want to do because that's, you didn't serve any purpose. Yeah, it didn't count. So wish I hadn't... Um, So I think, I'm not sure if you're supposed to hit it on the bounce, because it doesn't tell you how these shots are supposed to be defended. Oops. I know that. When you don't hit it, don't count. So I'm going to try to hit it off to the side. That should count. You know, that's what you want to do. Another little bonus thing you want to do is work on landing. So I instinctively turn my car to land on the wall square I, I didn't always do that it's something I've recently noticed um, I just do it subconsciously now I don't even think about it so now one of these flying ones we'll see see that's that's not a good hit what you want to do is try to hit it off to the side like that that's what you want to do you know, that's a good clear. That's a good save clear right there. That's that's the objective. Oops, god damn it. So here's one where I'm going to be flying. Land on the wall. 
No, I'm not near enough the wall. But just just start using the air roll and get your car situated um, to land on the wall with your four tires. I messed that one up. And uh, you're going to miss these in the beginning. You're going to miss these like crazy. You're going to be like, what the hell do I do? But you got to use the boost jump. And then practice on landing square on your wheels. Don't do that. Dang it. I was just trying to nick it to hit it to the side. Like that. And land square in the wall. Boom. You know, a little bonus effect to this practice. So I think that should count. So that counted. So this one's a little trickier sometimes, but I, I got it the first try. And then these the last ones are a little bit more simple. They're just like get in the way of the ball. But also can be effective. Sometimes you're facing the wrong way. This one's tough, though. But, got it. Those are the kind of saves you make in the game makes the difference between winning and losing. If you can pull off a save like that, just ask a little Cray. He made, in the early days, he was making all the saves, and I feel like I've gotten pretty good at making the saves. As we uh, completely missed on that one. See, how, I wasn't even thinking. See how I landed on the wall? Without even thinking about it, just had my car or, uh, orientated and uh, like land on the wall. Keep your momentum. That one's. I always forget what to do with this one. Should have warmed up with these before, but you know that's pretty. Going in cold, it's not a bad nine out of twenty. Um, so yeah, that's just what you want to do, and you. I, do it every day, do it twice a week. Um, you know, it's up to you, but I would highly recommend it. It really helps. So, yeah, thanks for uh, watching. Stay tuned for another video. If you find these helpful, let me know. Um, and we'll see you next time.